What's going on, my fellow VP blockers out there? You got you guy Larry here. We got a special show for you. Now, I'm putting my link in the description, my email. Feel free to reach out to me if you need advice on marriage, because um, I was married, divorce. I know what you're saying. Yeah, well, why would I get advice from you if you're divorced? Trust me, men, hit me up. <laughs> I'll share what I went through. Um, just investment advice. Uh, if I would buy a car now, a house now, what what funds I would get into. Now, full disclaimer, I am not a financial planner. I am not a licensed therapist. I'm just someone who lived a lot of life, made a lot of mistakes, and don't want you guys to go through this. When I mean guys, I mean all of you. Guys, girls, anybody. Anybody can hit me up in the email. Now, at the end of the day, this video, watch the whole video. Watch the whole video. A lot of you have an attention span of a walnut. How are you going to be wealthy and rich and financially independent if you can't watch a whole video? Okay? Watch the whole video to the end. This is a special video because this is for a subscriber who reached out to me, Silver Surfer. Shout out that I promised you. Uh, this person wanted to know about mutual funds, index funds, a little bit more about myself. Um, do I believe in the FIRE movement and is retirement actually attainable? Yeah, it is attainable because I know people who are retired. You have to do the work just like anything else. If you want to lose weight, you got to do the work. A lot of people think there's a pill that you could just swallow to lose weight. There may be one out there, but there's going to be side effects to it. When you take the hard road and you do it the hard way, you cherish it better. When you lose weight the hard way, you're you're more likely to keep it off because you know what you had to do to get it off. And you don't want to go through that shit again. When you invest slowly and you slowly build something, you don't want to mess your money up because you know what you had to do to get there. Now, about myself. I'm 40 years old. Grew up on the East Coast, tri-state area. Both of my parents made great money in their lifetime, but they didn't teach me about money. Nobody taught me about investing. Nobody taught me to invest in certain properties or, uh, you know, but mutual funds or anything like that. I had to learn a lot of that stuff on my own. And some friends actually put me on to this type of stuff. I knew about it when I was 19 and 20. I was jumping in and out of some stocks. And then the dot com thing happened and I sold out everything. Worst thing I could have did because some of the stuff I owned back then actually blew up. This is why you never sell stocks. But um, my dad worked till he was 70 and a half. I actually do what he does now. And my dad should have retired long before 70 and a half. You know, he has a pension. He had an annuity. He's on Social Security. But he didn't have to work that long. My mom retired at 67. She worked way too long. When you get that old and you never got a chance to travel when you were younger you don't do nothing when you retire because you bust your ass your whole life because you messed up with your money i don't want to go that route now i would go with index funds i wouldn't do actively managed funds if you want to know why i'm putting my email in the description you can email me uh for 35 bucks i have cash app zelle venmo for 35 bucks um you email me and we set up a time and I will FaceTime you through WhatsApp and we can talk and I can tell you what funds the blocker has. You tell me what's going on and I will tell you what would the blocker do. That's going to be the name of the series. Our one-on-one -on -one is going to be what would the blocker do. Now, a lot of people, they want to learn, but they're scared. They don't know what to do. They don't know which way to go. They don't know how to, how to, how to, that they have no clue on how to handle certain things. Here's the thing. If you need me to push you and be that voice in your ear, I got you for 35 bucks. Now, I know what you're saying, oh, $35, that's a lot of money. If $35 is a lot of money to you, you shouldn't be worrying about investing. You shouldn't be getting married. You shouldn't be buying cars and you shouldn't be buying houses. 
And you damn sure shouldn't be buying invisible cryptos. You should be worrying about how you can get your money up. So $35 will actually help you men and women get along in life to plant seeds where you can eat the fruit from the trees of those seeds that you planted. Now, I would not do, I wouldn't do funds where there's a fund manager. 95% of the fund managers cannot beat the total stock market index fund or the S&P 500 fund. If you want to know what funds I'm in, like I said, hit me up in the email. I'll tell you what I'm in. You don't have to do what I'm doing, but it's work for me. And it's very, you want something simple. You don't want to be the tortoise and the hare. Where one is one, one, no. You want something where it's slow and steady. Slow and steady. This is not a sprint. This is a marathon, okay? This is a very slow process, and a lot of people are going to get burned because there's quick money out there. There's quick money. A lot of people are going to get burned. Trust me. Now, the way I do things is slow and steady. You set it on autopilot. You live life. You don't have time to keep looking at this shit and picking stocks. Unless you're building a dividend fund, what I'm doing right now, and that's in time after you get everything set up in autopilot, then you can play around in your mad money fund and pick stocks and do shit like that. But I'll show you what I'm invested in. Nothing crazy. It's so simple where I pick big funds, huge funds that have been around since 1987, not some new shit that came out in 2016 and 2017. I pick old shit, old shit that's been around Test the time with huge assets in it, billions of dollars, 300 billion, 200 billion, not some little shit with four or five billion in it. No, we can go through this. We can go over what's going on in your life and what would the blocker do? And trust me, when you say it out loud to someone, sometimes you need to say it out loud to someone who you don't know and who you won't meet. And then they go, damn, um, I, here's what I would do in that situation. You know, but we can go over why actively managed funds have been proven to be worse than index funds. Okay. Is the fire movement attainable? Yes. Our rich journey. They had a goal. They stuck to it. Any goal you have, you have to stick to it. You have to do it. I wake up every morning before work at 3.30 and have six egg whites and two whole eggs and cream of rice cereal. On days I'm off, I eat at 7.30. Same breakfast every morning. Consistency, consistency. I write down things. You see me here with a notepad. I write things down. I go through it. Okay? I tear it away. Fold it up, I put it in my pocket with my cash, and, and I look at it. Sometimes I don't even look at my phone for reminders. I have the piece of paper. We'll go over everything. We'll, we'll spend an hour for 35 bucks. Time is money. If you, wanna, if you wanna get somewhere in life, sometimes you gotta pay to get there, okay? You have to pay someone for their time. I'm not gonna do it out the kindness of my heart. So I've been through a lot of this stuff. I've read the books, you know, I can take some books, contradict other books. I'm going to, I took a piece out of everybody's book, Benjamin Graham's, A Random Walk Down Wall Street, Peter Lynch. I took all that shit and I made my own thing like, okay, I want something safe, easy, not quick money, but going to build me money and something I don't have to look at every day where it's on autopilot and I link it to my checking and it's done for me. My email's in the description. Feel free to reach out about anything. Silver Surfer, reach out to me. Once we set this up through email, I'll FaceTime you through WhatsApp. We'll spend an hour. You tell me about yourself. Have everything written down, your wages, your debt, where you want to be, uh, 
Like what you really want to do, if you want to get married, if you want to buy a house, if you want to buy a car right now, if you want to invest, I'll tell you what would the blocker do if I was you, how, 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 how I would approach it. I'm literally, I'm better off than my parents are. I have more money now than my parents retired with. How about that? And I'm only 40. Because I started to listen to people who have money. Not a bunch of fancy shit. They have money. So emails in the description. Hit me up. Get after it. No regrets.